Hello, coolers, and welcome back to Viva Barca, the home of everything Barca. I had never imagined seeing FC Barcelona becoming so low, as I mean, so low as we can see it right now. And is this is really, really unbearable? Really, really unbearable. You know, I just can't, I just can't accept the fact that we are going down to the Europa League after how many years in top flight football in the Champions League. And that is just the harsh reality of things that we all as fans need to accept. And this just tells you that, you know, our team has some years to come back to regain. And I don't want to put blames on the coach or whatsoever. Things were meant to be like this and it's not it's not a good thing. And we saw the kind of performance we put against Bayern Munich yesterday. Very horrible. And it was not as if Bayern was playing good. Bayern was just playing the ball as, you know. I think Bayern's performance was poor. It was poor. But guess what? Their poor performance outplayed us. We were playing like kids. I saw a team, a bunch of 11 players on that field, feeling bullied. They were feeling bullied by Bayern. And it is very painful to watch when we see the display our team had yesterday in the Alliance Arena. It's really, really painful to watch. And now, come on, playing on Thursday night is really, really horrible. But that is the harsh reality. I will stress on that because it is what it is. It is what it is. What can we do? Because honestly speaking, Barcelona don't deserve to be in the Champions League. When we are talking about the form we have, we don't deserve it. We need to compete with the likes of oh, Anderlecht, Sevilla. Sevilla is far better than us. Dortmund also qualified just lately to the Europa League as well. I mean, even in the Europa League, there are teams there that Barca can't stand them. Let's be realistic, guys. There are teams there that we can't even stand them. Teams that we can't stand them. And of course, that is how low we have been come recently. How low we have been come. I don't want to start going to the performance yesterday in that match because you know, there were a lot of individual errors. There is Tegan. All of them played nonsense. The team was not performing well. They were feeling bullied and they, they played with a lot of fear in them. But that tells you that this team has a lot, a lot of years to recover. We need Javi to bring back this team the way it was. But one thing is for sure. We need patience. We need to give Javi time, you know, to to restore this team. Because I always feel that Javi is the man to take Barcelona back to the glory days. And the team is a broken team. Very, very broken beyond recognition as it stands. And when we even look at the finances of the club, there's no money. And had it been okay, the club had money, then it could have been faster to regain back this club. Laporta go to the market. We look for, we strengthen the squad. But now... What is Barca? Nowadays, Barca go for bench players. Bench players and the other teams, they don't even want to give. Go to City for their bench players and they tell you 70 million. That is that how low Barca have become nowadays? It's really, really horrible to see. But that is the harsh reality. We need to accept it. We need to accept it. I just think everything is well-deserved. Going to the Europa League is well-deserved. That is our place as it stands at the moment. And... When I see the media talking about can Barca beat West Ham United, all those trolls trolling at us, it's normal. Why won't they troll at us? Seeing a team of Barca State to go into the Europa League is very funny and very strange. And just, just we just need to accept all the abuse from other fans. We don't have no choice. The team is in serious shambles assistance, and we just need to accept the facts. We just need to accept the facts. And the game against Real Betis, you know, this last Saturday really exposed how difficult things are for Barca. And of course, Betis more than us for seven points. If we can't compete in a team like Betis, then how do we want to qualify for top four? How do we want to make it for top four? Betis is more than us, for example, for is it seven points? And we want to compete with them. We can't even beat them at the camp, no. Then I very much doubt, I doubt a lot if Barca can make it to the top four this season. Because playing Europa League back to back is unacceptable. It's very unacceptable. This is something that I don't even want to see. I don't even want to see. This is not, Europa League is not something I, I can tell you that, all right, come February when we'll be, we'll be playing a round of 32, I will cherish watching the Europa League. No, I can't. Then talk less of us qualifying again for another Europa League next season. It's going to be tough. Winning the Europa League is not that going to be easy for FC Barcelona. I, as I said earlier, the teams there are very competitive and strong. And when we see the Barcelona nowadays, 
they will suffer. They will really suffer against the likes of Borussia Dortmund, Sevilla, and name the rest. We can't cope. We can't cope with it. We can't cope with it. That is the harsh reality, guys. Very, very harsh reality that we need to accept. And we need to move on. Laporta needs to work a lot to bring back this thing. You know, but the mayor from the onset is the mastermind of all this nonsense we are going through. You are buying the likes of Coutinho, the likes of Dembele, the likes of Griezmann. Some crazy sum of money. That is bad. Bad. So we just need to accept the poor run that we are currently going through. I'm speaking with a lot of sadness and I, I just I don't know. But of course we were expecting this from Bayern yesterday. There was no there was no hope. Benfica, it was really difficult, really difficult to see Dynamo Kiev even having the result against Benfica because Barca at the end of the day, truth be told, they were hoping more for Dynamo Kiev to get the result rather than for Barca get you know going against Bayern to win. It's impossible. This Barca People who thought Bayern can can lose against Barca, surely they were dreaming. I'm serious. I'm serious. But of course, I like the the winning morale that Javi had to put to those players before going to that game, and which is good, which is good, which is good. But it is really really funny when you really put it serious on your head that Barca can even try and win by the Bayern. That is impossible. It's impossible. They played us as kids. We were played as little children yesterday. We played as we played so bad, so bad, so bad, so bad. So, of course, that's the reality for now. We just need to accept it and move on. We just need to accept and move on. So, please make sure you leave your thoughts down below on our situation as it stands. I would appreciate if we can discuss better down on the comment section. Thanks a lot for watching. Hope you did enjoy the video and also hope you did subscribe. If you haven't subscribed, please make sure to subscribe so you always stay in touch with the latest on FC Barcelona. Yeah, on Viva Barca. Until next time. Bye-bye.